All right, we're heading back to the uh, old Confederate fort to see if we can't find some uh, some more Civil War relics. We'll let you know what we find. Okay, I want to show you guys something. We are at a uh, at our honey hole, our Civil War honey hole, trying to find some relics. And this is known about. We got to leave it here, but uh. Right here in this tree where the tree is growing is the remains of an old cannonball. It's growing in the, uh, well, you can see it right here. Thought that was pretty cool. That's definitely something we have to leave. But uh, you can tell where the tree had grown into it. But the cannonball is uh, right here. And the, uh, the fort is behind us. So they just uh, put it here. I just wanted to share that with everybody. That the cannonball is still here. I'm it's still in its original place where it has been all this time. And... Here it is. All right. He just found our first coin for today at this spot also. Um, this place has been, people have always been here. So uh, first coin of the day is a 1913 Weedy. Pretty old Weedy, it was pretty deep too. Congrats on the first coin. Thank you. All right, I'm here in this sand. And uh, to give you some idea, that's probably a foot deep. I'm over a foot deep. Um, that's six inch blade, six inch. We're probably 13, 14 inches deep. Yeah. Um, I found this. Persevered. Persevered. I was hoping to find a coin. But uh, it's got, I don't know if you can read it. Sessions Clock Company, Forestville, Connecticut, USA. Um, not sure what it is, but it was very deep. Some type of relic. Not rusty. Not rusty. It's not rusted, which is really weird. All right, let you know if I don't know what this is, but it feels like lead. On uh, looks like just a, something big with a hole in it, but it it seems very old. But anyway, I don't know what it is, but it's very heavy. All right, I've got the top to a mason jar lid, the old porcelain. Uh, I believe the rest of the uh, the cash is still in the hole. You know the gold, gold and silver coins and all. I'm sure it is. Here's Dad over here. We're at the site. We're near a coastal area. And now we're at the site of an old 1700s trading post. Um, it was cleared out about a week ago. Um, so up until then, this was all wooded area. But I scanned across it real quickly and didn't didn't get any hit on metal. But Back then, I guess they were trading spices for axes or some mess, not necessarily coins. But it's still interesting to be here anyway. Like a baby. I just dug this um, probably about five inches deep uh, and this hole feels like lead again it almost looks like a, a bullet that's been shot straight down it's heavy like lead you get a lot of miscellaneous items like this out here a lot of uh, 131 readings and whatnot on the uh, e-track anyway 